students not allowed to hold a bake sale for charity on their campus. And the school admits it's because the proceeds would go to a lesbian, gay, bisexual, and transgender support group. Now, WSBT 22's Annie Chang is following this story. And Annie, this is happening at Andrews University. Which is the Seventh-day Adventist College, Rick, meaning it follows the rules of that church. That's why university officials say they ultimately could not allow the students to hold this fundraiser on campus because the money would go to homeless LGBT teenagers in Chicago and homosexuality goes against the Adventist beliefs. The students say they understand, but they disagree. So. Jonathan, Katie, and Eliel are the leaders of All for One, the unofficial gay and lesbian group at Andrews University. They came up with an idea to hold a bake sale on campus, raising money for Project Fierce. It's a group that provides shelter for homeless gay youth in Chicago. It's a cause that hits close to home. We've had students who are homeless once they came to campus and um, came out and were kicked out of their homes um, or came to campus homeless. But their school did not sign off. After waiting a while for a response, the university said no, Project Face doesn't align with the university's mission. Andrews president released a statement explaining the decision in part reading, quote, Andrews University recognizes the special challenges facing LGBT youth and believes that efforts to help them are worthy. But he goes on to say that the church does not support homosexuality and therefore, quote, Andrews University's policies do not permit the raising of funds to support the work of agencies that advocate behaviors contrary to Adventist beliefs. That should be our mission to help those who are struggling to find themselves and to find their faith. So the group launched their own fundraiser online and has gotten more support and more money than they ever expected. We were so blown away. Nearly $16,000, well over their original bake sale goal of $2,000. The university says it's open to an ongoing conversation about this fundraiser. In fact, early on in this process, early on in the discussion, the school did suggest another charity that would help homeless teenagers in general, not just LGBT exclusively. And the other issue here, Annie, is the school said it would have violated the student handbook. That's right. According to the student handbook, students can only raise money for causes that wouldn't conflict with, with the school's beliefs. All right, Annie, thanks. Mm -hmm. Organizers of Kindergarten.